Hey everybody, it's Paige. So today's video is going to be a TJ Maxx and Marshalls haul. I love watching these videos so much and I just recently went shopping so I thought I'd film one for you all. I know it's been, it's been a minute since I've filmed but I am back and that's all that matters, sort of. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to post regularly again and yeah, so if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. I would appreciate it so much. Leave me a comment, follow my other social media, whatever you want to do, go ahead and do it. I'll, um, I'd, I'd really, really appreciate that. But anyways, let's just get into the haul. So I've got some little home decor type items, some little accessories, and then some clothes. So I'm just going to start with the decor, home decor, because, um... It's on top. So, the first item. I am so excited about this. This is from Marshalls. Oh, you can't even see it. Okay, so this is what the top of it looks like. It's like a little hanging little crocheted thing with these little wooden beads on it. And it's like, you know, got different like textures of crochet. And I think this is just so cute. It's cream and... When I showed it to my dad, he said it was very 70s. I don't know if that is accurate or not, but if it's 70s, then I like the 70s. But um, I just thought it would be really cute to like hang up in my room. It kind of goes with my um, aesthetic that I'm going for. I'm trying to go for more like neutrally shades with pops of baby pink, if you could not tell from my background. But yeah, I really love this. My mom actually found it and she was like, you need to buy this. No, actually she didn't say that. She just said, Paige, I found something that I think you might like. Um, so the next item that I got, I got on the clearance rack actually. This is also from Marshalls. It is um, the Hearts and Stars woven cotton storage bin. And this is what it looks like. It is my perfect shade of baby pink and it's just like little like flexible little basket but it also like holds its shape. What is that seat doing in there? And yeah, I got this for six dollars. It was originally ten and I just thought it was so cute to like, you know, plop up somewhere. Not right there but anywhere. So I was kind of inspired to do this video by Samantha Sherman. I will leave her channel linked in the description box. She has done several videos like this video and my style is definitely, definitely inspired by her and I love her so much. She's one of my favorite YouTubers. If you love baby pink and unicorns and glitter, you will love her, hands down. Um, but this is something that my mom actually bought for me. She was like... Paige, I know like that you are into the whole baby pink thing and unicorns and I found something perfect for you and she bought me this. And I am so excited about this. It is a little unicorn head if you couldn't tell. And it has these little light bulbs and you put batteries in it and then light them, light them up but I don't have batteries in them. You actually need a screwdriver and I don't know where a screwdriver is so I couldn't like get it ready for this video but um, it is so freaking cute. The little light bulbs light up. This was $12.99 which I think is so adorable. And wait, what? It says batteries included. Say what? Well. Maybe they are included. I don't know. This is all that came with it. If they are included, they're they're dead. So, whatever. But I thought this would be like super cute to like put up here somewhere, you know, or like you can either set it down like just like on a desk or you can hang it up with the little holes that are on the back. But either way, this is so cute and I cannot wait to hang that up in my room. So exciting. Um, then I got a few little notebooks from TJ Maxx. I got a planner and then I also got a notebook. These were each $5.99. The planner says, hello 2018, which is a little bit early, but it starts 
in uh, it's a 17 month agenda and it starts August 2017 so next month and it's got the little um the like monthly um like layout and then it also has weekly and my dogs are barking and then there's just some like note sections in the back so I thought that was really nice planner and it was only $5.99. Normally I spend like 40 bucks on a Lily Pulitzer planner and that is just a waste of money honestly and I need to tone it down but I'm really excited to use that for work and school. Um, but yeah, I, I am I'm changing my major. Oh geez, that's a whole nother topic. Um, I was pre-nursing but I'm changing to nutrition and dietetics and I'm so excited about it. So yeah. Um, that was just a little fun fact. So I'm really excited to start school in the fall, um, my junior year of college, and use my planner. So exciting. <laughs> and then this is just a little notebook that I um, got. It's got this like rose gold like reflect detailing, and it's just, you know, a notebook. It has lines. I don't know if you can tell, but I love it. I think it's so cute. I think these are cute together to have my little little purse or backpack um but yeah i definitely recommend checking tj maxx out for little notebooks and um planners and stuff like um, that so i have two pairs of sunglasses that i got from tj maxx on clearance these are from nine west i thought these were just kind of cute like big chunky dark sunglasses and they're like a dark tortoise shell let me see if i can zoom you in a little bit I just thought they were really cute and they were like five dollars I think and I do have a very large face so bigger sunglasses are better in my opinion for me my style and then these are a little bit lighter um like a more typical tortoise shell like look and these are a little bit pointy on the ends sort of like a cat eye but like not really they're still kind of like big and cute and these were also like five or six dollars and these are from Franco Sarto Franco Sarto so I just wanted to show y'all those I thought those were so cute I definitely I there's they have a ton of sunglasses on sale right now at both Marshalls and TJ Maxx so definitely go check it out if you are in the market for some now we've just got a few clothing items and then we will be done so the first item is this little baby lavender shirt and it's just like a loose little t-shirt that has this little like cut in it and it's supposed to be like that but um it was on clearance for three dollars and i just thought it was really cute i love the color um you know very like springy summery bright pastel and it was only three dollars so i couldn't like say no and i think it'd be cute to like you know do a little tie up in the corner and um yeah, that's pretty much why I bought this. Um, then I bought these two shirts. These are like, they were in the athletic department. Ooh, we're gonna lose one. We're gonna lose one. Okay. These were in the um, athletic department. They're like, I'll show you the pink one first. So it's, it's like, this at the top, you know, kind of looks like a, a cardigan. You're like, okay, cute, cute cardigan, cute long sleeve cardigan. But then in the middle, it's like connected. I don't know if you can see. Do you see what I'm saying? It's like a very deep scoop neck almost that goes down to like the bottom of the shirt. And it looks really cute on, like you obviously have to wear something under it. So either like a sports bra or like a fitted like tank or something. And, um... Or like you know whatever whatever you want you can wear it for athletic reasons or for just like fashion which I'll probably do both like little like what do they call it like when you're wearing workout clothes but you're not working out um I don't know there's like a word for it but I just thought this was really cute and this one was on sale for eight dollars and oh athleisure athleisure that's the word so i also got the same exact one these are in a size medium and this one was on clearance for six dollars not sure why the gray one was cheaper but same exact thing this little crossy thing in the front long sleeve very soft very lightweight um yeah both size medium and the little lavender shirt this is a size large this one right here 
Then, the very last item in this haul. I was so excited to see this. This is by the brand Lucky Brand, and this is a size large, and this is a little bit big on me. Not gonna lie, but it was on clearance for $10. And this just like, it's like a jacket, right? You know, got little like, I'm not sure what this like material is called. Um, you know, it just like is open in the front and it's got little like frayed detailing right here. And then it has, let me flip it around. It's got this like tie um, that's like a little kind of crocheted-ish that you can like tie around the front. And so I don't know what this is called but when I saw it it just screamed like Chanel to me for some reason and I love the baby blue in it and the cream and it was only ten dollars so I just like had to have it um I really like it it is I would have liked a medium honestly but it was on clearance they didn't have a medium and it still it looks fine I'm a tall girl I've got like a bigger frame whatever bone structure so I can pull stuff off like this my mom tried it on she's like 5'5 five five, um smaller more petite than I am and it just like swallowed her but um I thought it was so cute and it like feels nice and you know it's just it's going with this whole like look slash aesthetic that I'm going for and I just was so happy to find that and yeah ten dollars for lucky brand jacket what 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 um but yeah anyways that was my tj maxx and marshall's haul i hope you all enjoyed if you did please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe i'd really appreciate it you can look forward to seeing more videos from me in the near future if you have any requests leave it in the comments below and i hope you all have a wonderful day and i will see you in the next one bye Page, 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 page. So today's video is going to be a TJ Max TG TJ. Um, you're making a lot of noise. Yeah, I actually you have to use a screwdriver, and I don't have a.